If not, then I could try to find something. Fifteenth oh, anniversary with Susan. I've known her for fifteen years now. And I hope this is worth it for everybody. Hi, Susan! Hello! It's my audience, but yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wow. Uh, you just. Never mind. <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say this is the perfect environment to make it's just uh, to make an uh, ASMR video. Yeah, that's part of what I was intending. Okay, okay great. Housekeeper. Yeah. Housekeeper. Yeah. Do you guys have any questions about my creations? Oh. Hey, Dylan. Um, Adam, I get you more. <laughs> I get you more. Uh, who would you say is the most powerful character? One of my most powerful that I've made, as far as I know, is the Endless, which is a amorphous being that feeds off of essence. It's inspired from Korok from the movie John Dies at the End. Interesting. It sounds like a vampire. It sounds like. Not a vampire. Think of it as like an amorphous cosmic blob that feeds off of essence, the energy that enables existence. That's one of my most powerful creations that I could think of for right now. But I know that there are some others, like around six to eight others, approximately. Well, it's relative, you know? Like, I do have different concepts for biological hybrids. Some of them are more obscure, like tires, um, tomatoes, houses, cars, donuts, cacti, stuff like that. I heard you could lose 20 pounds just by getting a haircut. Either 20 or 10, but I could have sworn from getting a haircut. That's crazy. It's for you, little friend. Yep, here. Video. Hello. Hi. Thanks. Yeah, Levi. Here. It's for you and for Susan. There you go. Hmm. Hey. <laughs> See no evil. Hmm. Um, so all the s'more stuff on this table here is client. All the s'more stuff over here is uh, staff. So oh. Yep. Semper Paratus. <laughs> yep. So this is like for you guys, and also there's a bunch of hot dogs that are just for everyone. Um, I will bring them out here in a second. Okay. So, should we use that? Yeah. Yeah, bring, bring some out. Good. Do you by chance know all your neighbors here? No. <laughs> That's fine. As long as we don't get any disturbia stuff. Yeah. 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 Yeah, I was the one to pick them out.
Good job. Your problem. <laughs> what did I do? Your uh, problem is a combination between you're welcome you and no problem. Thank you for explaining that. I learned it from Brian Regan. I don't think I feel responsible using this prong for s'mores, but I do like some assistance. Because what if I end up having a chard? What if I end up getting too close to it? Yeah, I mean, the way that me and my dad like to eat them is we like to light them on fire and then put them on the... On the... Yeah. I, I yeah. enjoy it that way, so... You remember the movie Sandlot? I actually, I haven't seen that in years. That's the first time I've ever heard of s'mores, as far as I know. That's cool. That was a classic when I was a kid. Do you want me to put a marshmallow on that for you? Yeah! Who did that? No, is it the best way to do it? What? For real? I would like... Yeah, that's how I do it. Um, yeah, I don't like how this like prong is all metal. Yeah, it's, it should be mostly metal. But what if it builds up the heat? What if it oh, travels? Uh, yeah, so it will only travel if like the metal part is up in like on the fire. Does that make sense? So you'll be good as long as you you're about that distance. Um, so what I do is I I light it on fire. Mm -hmm. I I then uh, smoosh it while it's on fire on the s'mores. Mm -hmm, okay. Um, and then I take a bite out of it. Um, sometimes it's on fire. Sometimes it's not. <laughs> Can you blow it out for me? Yeah. When the time is nigh. If you, uh, yeah, wow! If you need me to. <laughs> Doug. Hey, dude. Those are my marshmallows. Those mean years since I'm at my last marshmallow. Napkins? Blow it out. Blow it out. Blow it out. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, I'm ready for the s'mores. Cool. Maybe you can just go like this and turn them off. Yeah, let's not do that. Oh, you guys got pictures. Yeah, I used to be innocent when I was a kid and. Now I wonder if I still am. <laughs> How is it, Wayne? Oh, it's good. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Who, me? Yeah. Everyone here in general. Here in general? Yeah. A newborn child bears no sin. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yes, man. Doug? Hey, dude. Oh. Was that too much? Hey, Adam! Get Peter! Thank you. <laughs> okay. Is I'm gonna need some help. Me? Yep. Oh, okay. Oh, five seconds. Uh, one. Uh, that, that one's gonna be too bad. Let me grab it really fast and I'll see if I can not add another uh, piece of chocolate to it. Hmm. Uh. Crap. Crap! Yeah, it happens, so. Here, um. <laughs> I'll trade you. Go ahead and grab this. It's hey, going to be slightly messy. Uh, okay, give yeah, me yeah. <laughs> oh, mm -hmm. you know me At what point am I uh, allowed to eat? Because I don't want to burn myself. Um, you're not going to burn yourself on that. It's pretty not hot right now. Um, let me see if I can't. Yeah, I just ate, my, my one's burnt and I just ate it and then... Yes, <laughs> <laughs> um, please. But, Doug, I need my problem. Help you. Thank you so much. Okay. Also, you might need to use the bigger crackers for that. Hey, um... <laughs> hey, um, Doug, can you help me with this? Yeah, give me... Oh, is it on fire currently? No, he's just been waiting for stuff. I was told by a cooking expert that s'mores are considered a disgrace in the food industry. I did let the other staff know. Um, Omar said that he might come. Oh yeah, he said he, yeah. Yeah. Can you grab that chocolate? Oh, the paper is on the ground. Thank you. Wow. <laughs> yeah, well, like you is this your water? 
Excellent. Is it working? <laughs> it's like falling I think so. <laughs> Excellent. Now it's working. You want to say something to Susan? I hope my 15th anniversary is working. You know? This isn't directly to Susan, but I believe Susan's sitting right next to me right now. I could feel her essence nearby. Yet, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Mm hmm. I have faith. Yep. <laughs> Just be careful when you sit here. Oh, sorry, listen. There was also a sticker behind you. <laughs> No pay, no gain. It's true. Yeah, I've known a woman who was like you wait to jump in the world for a long time. Yeah. You know who I'm talking about? She ended up at the Roach Hotel. You can check in, but you can't check out. You know what I'm saying? Mm hmm. That's how it is. Mm. <laughs> we should back. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here. 